We have the um, we had the octopus, didn't we? Predicting success. Oh yeah. Something different. I saw this. But there's an animal that I would like to see the spirit of England having. Have you seen this raccoon, Susanna? Oh, I thought yeah. you were going to say a lion. Kate. No. <laughs> it's, a, a, it's a very interesting raccoon who scaled a 20-storey <laughs> building. It took him more than 20 hours. In Minnesota. It. Look at him. Going straight oh, up. Nobody quite knows why he kept going up. It, I mean, apologies for the everyday sexism, but it reminds me of my husband and men generally when they're driving. I, they I just keep going. Me. I think you're going in the wrong direction. Darling. Really no, no, no. It'll <laughs> be fine. Is it when you've locked the doors? <laughs> 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 when as he scales the walls. No, it just keeps it's going. Okay. So this is in Minnesota. A security did lock all the windows, apparently. Oh, so, so is he looking for a way in? Yes. Oh, bless him. Oh, but he could have just oh. turned round, couldn't he, and gone back down? No, but when you get Determined. really high, Kate, don't you find it's really hard looking back down? Oh, uh, that's care, true. You might come. panic. And he's probably it, a male raccoon. And he gets... Men don't go back to <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Thank you, Sean, for your <laughs> everyday sexism. Very good. Very good <laughs> indeed. Sorry about that. Uh, he did get oh, rescued very happily, but we could do with that determination, there's couldn't there's we? There's videos of him just on window ledges, just relaxing every now and again, just taking a breather and then oh. carrying on up. Checking out the windows. <laughs> right, thanks oh, a lot. Let me in.